മലയാള സിനിമ തനിക്ക് എന്നും ഒരു പ്രചോദനമായിരുന്നുവെന്ന് തെലുങ്ക് നടൻ ആദി വിശേഷ് ഗൂഢാചാരി എവരു തുടങ്ങിയ ഹിറ്റ് ചിത്രങ്ങൾ സമ്മാനിച്ച നടനാണ് ആദി വിശേഷ് ആദി വിശേഷിൻ്റെ പുതിയ ചിത്രം മേജർ തിയേറ്ററിലെത്തി മേജർ ഉണ്ണികൃഷ്ണൻ്റെ ജീവിതത്തെ ആസ്പദമാക്കിയാണ് ചിത്രം ആദ്യം ചോദിക്കേണ്ടത് താങ്കൾക്കും താങ്കളുടെ പേരിനും സണ്ണി ലിയോണായിട്ട് എന്തെങ്കിലും ബന്ധമുണ്ടോ മീഡിയ റാൻ വിത്ത് ഇറ്റ് കൈൻഡ് ഓഫ് ഫോൾസ് ഐ ഗ്രോ അപ്പ് ഇൻ സാൻ ഫ്രാൻസിസ്കോ സോ വെൻ ഐ വാസ് ഗ്രോയിങ് അപ്പ് ദർ സണ്ണി ലിയോൺ ഗോട്ട് പോപ്പുലർ ഫോർ അതർ റീസൺസ് ആൻഡ് മൈ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് ബിക്കോസ് സണ്ണി ഈസ് ഇൻ മൈ റിയൽ നെയിം ഇസ് ആർ ടീസിംഗ് സണ്ണി ലിയോൺ സണ്ണി ലിയോൺ ഐ സോ ഗൂഡാചാരി ദെൻ ഐ സോ ഇവർ ഇവരു റൈറ്റ് I loved Ivru. Actually, I loved it more than Gudajari. That's my, my personal choice, okay? Uh, when did you first really plan to come into movies? When I was five, I think. It wasn't mm-hmm. planned. It was just I loved movies. I remember taking my mom's chunni, tying it around my head, holding a plastic gun, pretending I was Rambo. <laughs> <laughs> so it was always there. Most actors, they have it. It's a childhood love. Because you get to play like a child. Um, major unikrishan is an emotion for us, right? When did you plan to write this and act? The way you said it, um, I saw the attacks. See, 2611 was done for TV. Hmm. It was done for the camera. I saw the attacks when I was in San Francisco. Hmm. I came home from pl- playing cricket or something mm-hmm. one day and I saw the attacks and I was shocked. I was like, what is going on? First, I thought it's a gang war. Yeah. Because that's what they were saying. Then they said it's a terrorist attack. And the next day, 27th night, Major Sandeep's photo came. I was shocked. This guy is so handsome. And my older cousin Pavan looks exactly like him. Oh. I look like him. So I'm like, who is this person? He looks like my older brother. Um, 31 years. Saved hundreds of people. Okay. National security guard. Okay. So that stayed in my head. Next year, Ashok Chakra was given. Okay. Uh, after that, uh, every birth anniversary, one interview from a friend, one new photo from his school, it come up but whenever they'd speak about him they'd say the hero of mumbai okay. the hero of mumbai i thought but i kept realizing that people only talk about his last 36 hours mm. but the 31 years before that he's even more beautiful but nobody knows the challenge also was that you can't take 31 years and put it into hours so there'll be a little bit of fiction okay. but Uh, so there's a little bit of kalpitam and fiction and all but at the end of the day uh, we told a story that is about his soul about his truth you started as a director right mm-hmm. then i was an actor only mm-hmm. but i didn't know how to audition mm. i didn't i'm not from film fam i'm an mm. outsider mm. I, i come from my own thing mm. so i didn't know what to do no one was hiring me so i directed now <laughs> <laughs> you you wrote and you directed the movie wrote right? directed acted produced everything yeah, everything was you Just to write and then act for the movies right are you comfortable that way right uh, acting for your own script not necessarily i think what happened is when you're an outsider you don't know anyone mm-hmm. um nobody considers you as the first option no? okay. and i don't like to audition i don't like the idea of sitting in front of someone and letting them decide my self worth so uh, i wrote out of necessity later once i got my fans and you know i became popular my film started becoming really successful um uh, i have one unique thing that everyone's fans likes my film that is my well, well, <laughs> unique uh, because i don't try to you know to show off mm. um once i did that i started doing some outside films mm. as well but my biggest hits have been the scripts i wrote you wrote yes yeah. guda jari yeah. yeah right that uh, you wrote right guda jari yes. i wrote guda jari i wrote shanam um i wrote this ma- major yeah. uh yevaru i didn't write mm. but i gave a lot of feedback did you uh, train as an nsg uh, officer uh yeah i mean Because see i'm i'm known for my action films yeah. and i'm left handed oh so I, i it's more of a james bond kind of thing so i'm doing it with style and then i realized that major sandeep is the polar opposite steady he's a super soldier 15 year veteran um see in india army is the elite mm. the elite in army go into national security guard mm-hmm. major sandeep is the training officer of the national security <laughs> guard so elitist me, of the elite yeah so me a telugu action guy is supposed to be the actual elitist of the elite and i'm left handed <laughs> when i run i put out my left leg 
So it started with that changing the way I walk, the way I stand, the way my voice sounds, um, the way I move. Um, and to move with a gun, reload the magazine, drop it, take pick up another gun, move without the shot cutting and do it in a way where it's natural and real, not for mm -hmm. style. Mm -hmm. And look like a proper soldier. That takes a lot of work. You had tactical training? Yes. There is a lot of attitude in the cinema. Is there an audience or you write from inside? I think it is because I didn't grow up here. Huh. See, my first... Growing up in the US... See, here when you grow up in school, you tell the pledge. There's the Janaganamana you do, uh, Independence Day celebration, yeah. Yeah. Independence Day Mela. All that. In US, there's nothing. Hmm. So, I discovered my love for India on my own. Uh, I remember 1996, A.R. Rahman's Vande Matram came on TV, Saturday morning program. Mm -hmm. I suddenly stood up. Everyone was like, why are you standing up? I said, no, no, I'll watch this song only by standing up. So, it started like that. So, I fell in love with India after I grew up. With this film especially because we have a hashtag for the movie, uh, Jaan Dunga Desh Nahi. It's not on this poster, mm -hmm. but on the Hindi poster we have, Jaan Dunga Desh Nahi. Uh, I'll give my pranam, but I'll not give the day some, right? Oh, yeah. um, because I think that is the way Major Sandeep saw the world. He was friends like that, his love was like that, his wife, his parents, everything with that lens, he saw the world. People have a lot of They have a flurry of content. All the technical details are in the cinema. To what extent is cinema you give the best of technical perfection? In general, Malayalam cinema is extremely technically good. Um, uh, when I was watching even certain... See, Telugu cinema, we do very stylish stuff. Mm -hmm. But even the stylish shots in Bhishma Param look very good. Uh -huh, yeah. The poster design is very good. Um, what I was able to see, like the colours in Kumbulangi Nights when they are showing the lake, mm -hmm. is very correct. Mm -hmm. So, we took great care to make sure this film looks very international. Telinga cinema is a part of the Telinga cinema. There are a lot of mass movies. Larger than life, all characters, heroes, all of them. But your movies, it had an element of a human element that we can believe you. Cinema believe you. In the same time, when you started, confident that this will work out. Definitely. I think I like, I like heroism. But I like it with a little real. Mm. Like I think that's why uh, what Prithviraj sir did with Lucifer, mm. I really liked. You know, like that scene where uh, Mohanlal sir is walking in the street and then everyone stops and like the traffic stops and like you realize that he has everything, mm. like it, everything's mm. going to move, his power. It is a very hero, it's a pakka mass, yeah, right, yeah, right. it's a very mass yeah, right. scene. But it's done so elegant, not over the top. So even a mass movie like Lucifer, for me has that swag. So, I, I like that. If you look at my film, Gudachari, um, I we try to get that. There is commercialness, mm -hmm. but we keep it grounded. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Malayalam cinema is inspired by that. So many, so many, so many. I mean, I'm a big, uh, I love Mamuti's films. Uh, Mamuti sir's films. Um, he recently did a straight Telugu film also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Dulka is a friend. Uh, like for example, when I saw uh, Ayyapuram Koshyam, mm. for example, I loved that they were able to tell a big saga but keep it so real. Mm. Like when they're beating each other up, they're not flying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I like that. Um, and I think that influenced what I'm doing. Um, it was so funny um, when I saw the ending scene of Lucifer, that uh, very stylish uh, mm. black mm. snow. Mm. We did that one year before that in Godachari. Oh. So I thought, okay, there is a yeah, similar yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, sentiment. There is a similar way of looking at things. Do you love your weakness or you love your strength? I know my weakness. So I hide my weakness and love my strength. <laughs> <laughs> what will be major giving in theatres? Will it be a cry or will it be a happiness? Major Sandeep... <clears throat> His sunshine. I spoke to a hostage. I spent a couple of days mm -hmm. with him, who was saved by Major Sandeep. He's a Telugu man. He's telling me, sir, when he walked in, 
I felt like Surya Putra. Oh. That's why in the trailer of uh, Major, you will see so much sunlight coming in. So I feel like Major Sandhi brought light into the darkness. Uh, one of the best experiences of Major was day before yesterday. We did a show for the National Security Guard in Mumbai. Mm. These are proper, uh, as we said, elitist of the mm -hmm. elite. So if I do something wrong, <laughs> they know. Yeah, yeah. And there are many people there who have the same exact job profile as Major Sandhi. Oh. Training officer. Mm. In 51 mm. SAG and 26 SAG. Mm. After the film, see in Jaipur, Ahmedabad, Pune, there were cheers, people were screaming, mm. people were crying, people were joy, it's a celebration. Mm. But here it was spin drop silence. We got scared, like, what's going on? Like, did we do a mistake? You know, what's the problem? They said, come to the headquarters. Army is calling me, that what's going on. So we went there. The show started at 8. Mm. At 11, they said, come to the headquarters. At mm. 9. I'm like, what is going on? So by, we reached there by 12. And by the time we went there, I brought this to Kerala because mm. they gave me this. This is a medal. Oh, that's awesome. This is a medal from the National Security Guard. Can I have a look? The, yeah, it's so heavy to look. Nice. This is like winning an Oscar. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know, um, I think you just keep it all with you always, right? Yeah, I've I've <laughs> been I've been showing it off to my parents, <laughs> to my friends. In every interview, I'm showing it off. I showed it off on the plane also. I <laughs> see. <laughs> you said it today. So I, I think, as you said in the beginning of this interview, Major Sandeep is not a movie. Is an emotion. Exactly. And I genuinely believe we captured it. Absolutely happy meeting you. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks a lot. lot.